What's your experience with parking? Uh, it's horrific. <laughs> it makes working down here really hard. It makes the experience not what it should be. It's not the Olympia way. You said you find other lots of parking and you've had some problems there. I have. I've parked my vehicle in a parking lot where you pay to park all day. My vehicle's gotten broken into. My windows have been smashed. My vehicle got um, actually dented the entire side and nobody left a note. I've paid thousands of dollars to try to park down here and it only makes it worse. What do you hear from your customers? It's really hard. They want us to be able to give them permits because they can't get up every two hours in between their tattoo sessions to be able to go pay for parking and move their vehicles. It's, they make it really hard down here to be a part of the Olympia environment. So the parking's limited to two hours on the pay spots? Even, it doesn't matter how long you pay, you have to move your vehicle every two hours. You can pay for all day and you still have to move every two hours. Yeah, they chalk your tires. <laughs> a client thought they could park in the bank parking lot and then they ended up with a $45 bill um, for parking there for 15 minutes. <laughs> so we just had to make sure everybody's aware where not to park. Make sure you know where you're parking because you might get a ticket unless you park in the right spot. We've been down here for a long time, so we just had to make it work. Basically, the best thing to do is just inform our clients and make sure you bring change, look for parking on the street in the area where we are uh, work. I've never been anywhere where it was like this. We've never owned a tattoo shop in a downtown area. We're usually in different locations, and this is one of the main reasons why. They make it really hard to be down here. Um, you can't stop what you're doing in a business to go move your vehicle. I can afford to pay all day, that's not a problem, but moving my vehicle's location every two hours is really inconvenient, and it's sad. And you said you'd rather pay the parking ticket than... I would rather pay the parking ticket than move my vehicle and inconvenience my customer. Our office is all wallpaper with tickets, parking actually. Tickets. <laughs> That's got to be really frustrating. Yeah, it yeah, is. It is. Really expensive, actually. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> the only parking lots we have are not in eye shot of our business, so we have to park to where we can't even see. And then that's what happens. My vehicle's been broken into and my truck has been damaged. In most cases, I have no issues with finding downtown parking. Once in a great while, right around 11 o'clock, I do have issues. Middle of the day gets a little... Yes, yes, but right around now and on, I don't have any issues at all. And do you, do you have to look very hard, or is that kind of the idea? Do you just circle around and you find... No, it? I just stop circle around maybe a couple blocks, and then I'll find something. Okay. How's parking in Elma? What do they do there? They don't have any parking meters. We don't have any issue with parking at all. <laughs> well, it's so small anyway, yeah. 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 Do you come to town very often? Oh, yes, at least twice a week. And it is, so the parking doesn't keep you away from coming? No, down. no, no, it doesn't. 